During COVID, a combination of low inventory and high demand have caused housing prices to soar. We've had buyers this year pay 10 and 20% over the asking price. According to the New Hampshire Association of Realtors, the median cost for a single family home was $402,000 in the month of May. That's an increase of 25% from the same time a year ago. In Rockingham County, where Portsmouth and Exeter and Durham are, the price of a median price topped $500,000 for the first time ever. Last month, 1,331 homes were sold in the state worth $646 million, 43% higher than the dollar amount of May of 2020. The average amount of days a property stays on the market is currently 25 days. That's 25 fewer than a home would have sat a year ago. We just listed a fairly modestly priced house, a condo actually in close to Portsmouth Friday, and we had uh, 15 showings on it and four offers, and the lowest of which was the asking price. According to the association, home values also escalated during the pandemic because there were fewer homes on the market and an increase in qualified home buyers taking advantage of record low interest rates. I think a lot of people were a little that would have normally sold last year and early this year have delayed putting their homes on the market because of the pandemic. You know, they didn't want strangers tromping through their house you know, perhaps bringing COVID in with them. With COVID restrictions easing, realtors say there are more homes hitting the market and are optimistic that the rate of increasing housing costs could slow down. Mike Cherry, WMUR News 9.